This is Headingley and it's here that history will be made on the evening of Friday, June the 10th, 2011. It will stage the first ever international origin match, England versus the Exiles. The Exiles coach Brian McLennan has flown into the country and the England coach Steve McNamara has named his squad. To be able to select uh, from a lot of strength and depth is probably what we uh, are craving to do. Uh, are we at the finished product yet? Absolutely not. We've got a long way to go, absolutely. But we're striving very, very hard, making some adjustments to our programmes and trying to continually improve. So I think this, uh, the 22-man squad we've picked, obviously, minus our injured players, minus our players who are based in Australia, uh, and minus some of the players who, who are, have, haven't actually made this squad, shows how strong uh, we are at this moment in time. You know, uh, I want to win. And, uh, you know, if you, you, want, you want to win, you've got to do your work. And, uh, so. We've all been doing a lot of work behind the scenes, and you know, but the, the important stuff's come now. Um, you know, we've we've got to narrow down the 22 down to 18 over the weekend, and then get the the players in, uh, gel them together. Uh, you know, get get everybody bonding together and giving them a cause to to, to play for, and that's obviously. Uh, representing where we come from. We went on the tour, minus some of our senior people, and the ones who went out there did a tremendous job. Some of our young people had to learn how to lead and lead by example, and, and James Graham did tremendously well in the tough circumstances with both Adrian Morley and Jimmy Peacock falling down with injuries. So uh, what he's created now with Jamie coming back and Adrian Morley coming back and Kevin Sinfield being back, it's some natural leaders back into an environment, but joined by another bunch of people who have been out on a, on a on a tough tour and experience the opportunity to lead. So we've actually got a, a whole lot stronger senior group now than ever before. The, the importance of a captain is uh, it's probably overstated a little bit within the game and that you don't to make too many decisions with the game. It's not like a cricket captain. Um, you get to do stuff like this, speak to the media and also you get lift, lift the trophy at the end of it's a lot of it. It's just about probably how you conduct yourself during the week as much as how you, how you play on the field as well. Well, this is what they'll be playing for the inaugural International Origin Match trophy, but who will lift it? Will it be the Exiles, Danny Baderas or England's Jamie Peacock? We'll know on June the 10th. Yeah, I want to win. We want to win. That's the aim for England this week. We want to get, we want to get out there and, and beat the Exiles. And uh, if we get to do that, I get to do some of the good stuff and lift the trophy. So that's a, a real aim of this week. You know, one of the people you're up against is JP, Jamie Peacock. Obviously, you've got a lot of respect for him. Yeah, that all felt a bit weird there, uh, holding the trophy together. But um, of course, and it's great to see that the big man back um, doing what he does best, um, leading England. And he's obviously one of the most passionate men, passionate men I've come across. And uh, you know, hopefully, um, they can finish off his career in, in the England jersey the way, way he can and the way he wants. How do you see this game going? Yeah well obviously both teams have to be at their best to or play pretty well to win um, and that's the way it should be. Uh, we've got a, a lot of you know, a few flamboyant players in our team but we also need to play grinding style and it's a bit of a balance isn't it? You need to, to grind and, and take your opportunities in a test match and, and that won't be no different on Friday night. What this is effectively is the best players in Super League play. That's what it is. Uh, so you've got the best English players playing and you've got the best overseas players playing. So um, it's a winner. It's, it's going to work. And uh, you know, get along here on June the 10th and you know, it's going to be a cracking match because uh, number one, England are very proud of, of their history of rugby league and England are always very hard to play at home. Um, and as Aussies and Kiwis, well, you know, we're pretty damn proud of where we come from too, so we'll be doing a good job.